So I was walking by this farm stand uh, today, and the sign I thought was a little strange. It said duck, comma, eggs. And I thought that's strange and unnecessary. Then it hit me. We're going to play some Dwarf Fortress today. We have a, a world that I that I started a while back, and this world has a goal. We're doing a new Embark today. Brand new Embark. And our job, our goal, is to conquer the world. So we got the small map. And on this small map, we are, of course, the dwarves. There's rat folk, there are gnolls, there are nagas. Added a few mobs in there. And uh, we're gonna we're, we're gonna destroy everything. So the dwarves are right here. There's my my castle from last time. It didn't go quite as planned. There may be some rat folk infesting it at the moment. Uh, quest castle. Uh, there are some humans laying to the south. There are some uh, dark goblins around. There are some rat folk in my hillocks as well. There's the nagas down this way. So we're gonna come in here. We're gonna build ourselves a, a fortress. We're gonna equip the fortress quickly and storm across the world. Let's go, um, let's go find a place to start. Um, now, I th think we want to go, so I'd like to be kind of near my, near my people, you know, which are over here. We could do like this, the dune of societies. Hmm. There's an aquifer in there. There's oh, probably always gonna be an aquifer around, but we could like, I kind of want to like dig into the mountain. You know, that sounds more exciting. Well, obviously, because we're playing to a fortress. So let's do something like... We can come over here. There's some elves over here. We can probably kill some elves pretty quickly. They got grizzly bears and all that, but that's no problem. Um, I think maybe so we go somewhere like around this way. Who's that? Hey, Tubbs. Thanks for the sub. Something like right in there. That little patch right there. Not going to be a lot of trees. There's going to be a little bit of aquifer where the desert is, but that's... That seems nice and hot. Let's try this. I'm not gonna even set my guys up. We're just gonna get in there and start playing. All right, Dwarven Outpost, you have arrived. After a journey from the mountain homes into the forbidding wilderness beyond, your harsh trek has finally ended. Your party of seven is to make an outpost for the glory of Zengo Drimtar. No supplies left, but with stout labor comes sustenance. With a bolt plower hook, provide for your dwarves. Caravan will come in. Hopefully, we don't get a bug. We kind of a bug last time. Enough time to delve secure lodgings ere the leopards get hungry. New chapter of Dwarven history begins here at this place. Olanalath. Tongues bolt. Tongues bolt. Excellent. How are we doing here? Oh, it's like all desert. I thought we'd have some mountain. <laughs> okay. It's all desert. There's like two trees. Um. Oh, no, wait, never mind. Oh, it's... Oh, never mind. Hang on, I thought that was the edge of the map. Check that out. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, hang on. I looked at it wrong. That's perfect. We're like, it's just like a cliff. Okay, excellent. This is exactly what I want. That's so, like, symmetrical. Um, do we want to build in the corner? Just because it's right there? I think we have to. Okay. Yeah, we'll walk without rhythm here so we don't get those sandworms on us. Uh, okay, so let's go dig over here. Um, we'll do something like that. Dig our way back this way. I think I'm on fast speed. Let me slow this down a little bit. Uh, I think I'm on super speed here. I forget the uh, the way to change that. Um, there we go. Okay, that should do it. Okay, so I'm gonna go dig that thing out. Um, what is that? That's claystone. That is silt. Tetrahedrite. Okay. We'll dig back this way. And then we'll go and put in a, uh, a nice square room right there. So we've got like hematite in the wall. There's some silt over there. Yeah, we'll have like that. And uh, I kind of like that's like so sim I love it. It's so symmetrical. Uh, okay, let's do a little bit of not that one. Uh, let's clear out this ramp here. We'll have a nice a nice doorway there. We'll get everything packed in here. We'll just get everything thrown in real quick. I want to get I want to try to see if we can get things as done as quickly as possible to get like 
set up here because we got we got an empire to build. Uh, we've got some folks to destroy. There is some rat folk over here that have not only we are at war with them, but they've also like stolen my um some of my friends. Um, oh, you know what? We're actually the other dwarves this time. <laughs> it's okay. I kind of like this one because we're only got one settlement this time. I think. Um, is that us? No, no, no. Never mind. Sorry, I'm confused. That's us. The dignified castle is us. That's our old one right there. Quest castle. The wordy hammer was us. Now we're over here. Okay, so we're gonna go. We're, we're gonna destroy some rat folk. Step one. Destroy rat folk. Step two. Elves. Okay. Let's dig. Stole my relic. They, they not only stole my relic, they like conquered the place. So I sent out my army to go and try to kill them. And then they captured a bunch of my army. And then uh, we weren't getting any migrants in. Um, a lot of tetrahedrites. Uh, and then the uh then they attacked let's do like you know what we're gonna we're gonna go on this this might be kind of tedious but we're gonna go on this this diagonal this time just because it's weird and i love it like that we'll do another one over this way just for the weirdness factor um, what was that? Two, three, four, five, six. Four, five, six of that. Yeah, like that. What happened to the volcano fort? Uh, I think we just retired it. I don't think anything bad happened to it. I think we just retired it. We, uh, I completed my moat. It was, a uh, like we had like a castle, a pink castle. With a with a vault with a magma moat around it, I don't think we died. I think I think we just called it a day. I think. <clears throat> um, okay, so we'll get some stuff moved in here. This would be like, yeah, you know what? Let's let's try to be symmetrical here. I want to be think fast, but let's 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 be a little symmetrical here. Uh, I'm gonna bump this speed up just a little bit. Like we'll go to like. Um, 150 just to move things along a little bit um, I'm hoping we can get like if this is all dirt we'll build our farms over here I was going to do farms here but this isn't all dirt so we'll get some farms where we can get them in here we'll get that dug out uh, I do want to make sure that we get another person in here doing miney things um, which is going to be probably risen you go mine buddy go get yourself a pick help us out here What's all this? This is claystone and this is tetrahedrite. Okay, and that is all stone there as well. So we'll, we can, we can still put it in there. We can put the steel like on this side or whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and set that up and we'll build in our, um, our farm right here. Let's get our pump helmets in there. there we go. They won't all fit, but. Yeah, we could certainly go up. Ooh, there's a jet up there, even. Yeah, an, an upside-down fortress. I like the sound of that. Okay, so we want that to be... Plump helmets all the time. Get those in there. We'll go ahead and get our... Um, oh, go to the kitchen. Don't eat the plump helmets. Okay. Okay. Get those things done. Um, okay. I'm trying to make some interesting looking things here. Okay, we'll do it like that. We'll sort of we'll build it out and then we'll fill some things fill some things in. Eight. 
But that's not gonna work because of that. Um. Here we go. Here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. That one, and then that. Like that. Okay. There we go. Animals. Yeah, let's set those guys up. So we want to put in a um, pin, which we'll just set up like that. Not much for them to eat, but they need something. Let's get you guys. What else do we have? A couple horses. Okay. Get to work. Sleeping in there. Uh, this is going to be my, my still. Look at all that jet we have in here. Uh, let's get a farming still. Which will go right there. And I'm going to put my kitchen in there also. Like that. So food land can be over there. Still that. Um, I don't know where I'm gonna put my 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 stockpile, which might go like up or down. That would be cool. It wouldn't be as defensible. Walkways and balconies over the cliff face, but it would be cool looking. Um, do I put the stairwell like back here? Do we go dig up? Do we build off this way, or do we put it somewhere else? We put it in the middle of the room? that. Then click right. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> it's kind of a cool idea. Okay, what we'll do is we'll throw in, this will go here, and we may set up a stockpile land somewhere nearby. Okay, let's get, so we got that done. Let me get uh, some of my dwarves organized here. Yeah, yeah, you go away. Um, so I want to get a broker, which is going to be Moldath, bookkeeper, Cyril, medical dwarf, nobody, manager. Moldath. Um, what was the what was the thing I used for um, names? Quick name. I forget how I did that. How did I do that before? And then, oh, it's still in there. So it just named the dwarves automatically, right? Yeah. Nice. From my list. Hey, look, there's Jeff. Jeff's our, our um, he's expedition leader. Of course he is, because Jeff's a hero. He won the death match for this month. Excellent. Okay. Um, let's go get, um, so we can do that, like, let's go this way and stockpile. <clears throat> Rigged. <laughs> okay, and then we're gonna go up. Um, maybe one more. If it left me, actually. Yeah, we have to. We have to uh, oh, you know what? How, how do I do that? I forget how to do this. If I want to build, I probably should put more in there. Like that, right? I think that's how I do it. Okay, dig. There's some bugs in there. Outrageous. 
Um, let's go get some shops set up. And so I think we'll have this to be like main area, like in all that kind of stuff, tavern, tavern area. And we'll go upstairs and we'll have stockpile land. Um, we'll put in like a walkway here. And this will be like workshop land. some workshops over there is that that's not squared at all <laughs> what am i thinking um um why did i why did i do it that way well you know what that's cool it's cool it's a little bit more that and then and then um just like i planned it <clears throat> it's organic exactly okay so we'll put in our carpenter shop and all this stuff i guess i gotta get in there quickly i always get stuck doing this <laughs> hey sagacious food 25 months thank you very much um let's get some things made so carpenter shop we want a mason. We want a crafts dwarf. We want anything else we need immediately. Nothing immediately, I don't think. Okay, so, oh yeah, I was gonna come in here and do this. work order we'll get ourselves so we'll go in and we'll set up i can go upstairs we'll put all the bedrooms and maybe offices maybe the offices could be downstairs um what i want is my still brew drink from plants um and i want like 75 of those things oh, oops 75 of those things um but if there's less than 45, make some more. Okay, so there's there's those. For these right now, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get them to do some jobs. So we'll just make some beds. What's that? No wood. Needs logs. Yeah, there's not a lot of logs around here. There's like one tree. This whole map is one tree. Not even a tree, it's a cactus. So we're gonna have to. We may need to dig down and get some logs. Is there anything on top of the mountain? There's one there. Hmm. There's a severe lack of trees in this map, isn't there? You'd think the desert, desert would have a few more trees in it. There it goes. So whenever we get a trader in here, we're going to buy some trees. We can always dig down, like, into the cavern and, and get our trees that way. But that'll at least get us started for beds. We can make everything else out of stone, so it's not that big a deal. But we'll get a few beds made. Seven of those. So down here will be the inn. I'm not sure what I'm putting on the sides just yet. Maybe a barracks or something. Uh, and then we're going to go up. Did I do that correctly? Place may not be the best idea. Did I do that right? Up, oh, it should be. That should be right. I forget how to, these stairs are always finicky. You know, I forget if that's actually. Right. I don't think it is. Hey, hi, Foss. How are you? Okay, so let's just do it this way. We'll have a row back here for a bigger staircase. Actually, that like this. Like that. 
We'll just go up that way. It's always finicky messing with these things, and I can never remember how to do it, so we'll just, we'll just do it the old-fashioned way and make our own. Okay, so stockpile land's going to be over here, so let's go set this thing up. So we got, you know, we'll put them in, in rows. Row of wood. Row of stone. Row of leather. Row of bo of blocks. How about a row of weapons? Not the most. Uh, when we get some crates in here, it's fine. Furniture row. Finished goods, of course. Maybe a couple finished goods. Um. I'll put a backup row of food up here. We'll do a row of ammo. This is a, I've never done this before. We'll see if this works. Um, probably not well. A row of cloth. Armor. I suppose I could have just gone, could have just gone in order. Um, ammo. Animals. Done. Okay. There we go. Oh, there's fish. Okay, so we'll get... We'll move food and stuff around shortly. Um, I do want to go ahead and put in, like, right there. Oops. Um, here. We're going to put in a custom food one. And I want only drinks. And only drinks. Just so we have a spot for drinks, just in case. Uh, we'll probably make one of these like a storehouse. If this is going to be the tavern. Uh, which, this guy can go make. Um, let's go do... Um, okay, so up here. We'll branch off. I'm trying to make... We'll try to be crafty here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then like that... One, two, six, and then like that. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I see what I did. Like that. Um, that's claystone up there. Okay, this is where our offices will go. Those will be statues lined up in there. If we ever get a mayor, we'll put him over here as well. That'll be a good setup for now. Up one more layer. This is going to be hematite land and bedroom land. But for right now... It's just going to be um, a dorm. We'll just have like a big opening here like that. And we'll make that a, a bed. Bed's in there. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set up. There's a horse out there. Uh, let's go put in um, a wood stock pile right there next to our wood place. Put a stone one here next to Stone Man. And that guy will be whatever. <clears throat> uh, sorry, Albert, I missed you. What is your favorite game of all the exotic games I've played? I think Caves of Cud was my favorite, but I didn't yet put enough energy in the Dwarf Fortress to fully appreciate its potential. Um, my favorite game, like ever, is the original XCOM. My, uh, I guess... I suppose Dual Fortress is my probably my second on that list. Master of Orion 2. That one's up there. I love that game. Um ooh, Limonite. Oh um The old Sid Meier's colonization has a soft spot in my heart. Hey Matthew, how are you? Welcome to the stream. 
Okay, is that done already? Okay, cool. Uh, let's get some beds. Bed. We'll just do the planners fine. There we go. This will be a bedroom. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and set it up as bedroom. And it's going to be a dormitory. Um, that's the one I wanted, not, not bedroom. Uh, yes. Uh, don't worry. I can hit the right button. Is that how I do it? There we go. Okay. Dormitory, so they can all share that. They'll probably want a bed or a door, which we don't need doors just yet. So let's go make some doors. I'll do that over here. Oh, um, I put these in here because I wanted to get um, an office for my manager already. So let's go make a chair. Uh, I want a table and a throne. Probably a couple of each. Do I have someone to go do that? Sure, someone actually, we actually, I'm not sure we actually have someone to do that. Oh, yeah, we do. Uh, Augustine is doing it. Cool. Fighting some Kias out there. Yeah, speaking of, we should probably get some of these things moved in. I guess we've got a lot of it here. Um, we can go make some crates. Uh, I mean, not out of wood. Um, what if the, what's the uh, crate, the stone crate called? Not a coffer. Is it in here? Jug? Pot. Pot. Rock pot. Make a couple of those. What do I think of the new Master of Ryan remake? The one that came out like in 2014 like or something? That one? Um, that was okay. I mean, it it was, it was fun. It was fun for a um, space strategy game, you know. Um, I'm sure it's just nostalgia why I'm a fan of Master of Ryan 2. I've played it many times, even after, like recently. Uh, I still love that game, but I'm sure it's all nostalgia. But it's something about the, the simplicity, yet, yet... There's not a lot of complexity, but the the simplicity and the what complexity there is in the original Master of Ryan, one and two, I love. And I don't think anything, no space game has has topped it yet. Uh, we'll get some doors in here eventually. So we'll get this this office done, and we're gonna mark it for um, Bookman Augustine. There you go, buddy. So you go, um, you go keep the books. And I think is it set up already? Already as? Yeah. Oh, I need to check that. Don't show me again. Um, where is he? Highest precision. Okay, good. So keep that all managed. And I need. I did the wrong one, didn't I? Um, office. I need a a. My manager, which I guess is Jeff, can have that one. Okay, and now that we've got um, a chair for this guy, we're getting a chair for this guy. Let's get some rock doors. Rock door. And I want to make, um, you know what, just make 10 of them, that's fine. Make 10 of them, that'll be a good, a good amount. There's Jeff's room there. She can go think about things. And that was... Am I right about that? That was Jeff that was doing that? I want that one to go away. That go away. Um, no, it is... Okay, I'm... Yeah, so... so Bookkeeper there. I need both of you guys to have an office. And Jeff has got an office now. Okay, cool. So he'll go around. He'll tell people to make the, make the still work and all that. Withered plump helmets. What? How dare you? Um, I need more store. I need more storage space here. Um, I think I can probably get away with a couple bins. If, 
Correct me if I'm wrong. Um... There isn't a there isn't a replacement for bins, right? There isn't a rock replacement for bins. Pots replace barrels. But bins don't have a replacement. They have to be wood. Am I right about this? Like, I don't mind you having bins. I'd rather well, actually, I don't really care. They can all have bins if they want. So we made a we made a bin. I can limit them, I suppose, to one bin so they don't get carried away. But you can see what it does for us. It piles everything into there rather than it being sort of spread all over the place. We'll just have to get some wood. Whenever we get traders in here, we'll get some wood set up. Uh, what is it? Is it? It's summertime. Let me go ahead and set the trade depot right here at the door. Um, this would be a cool one to have like on a perch out here. Get that done. Um, probably get some migrants here shortly. And did I get any doors yet? Let's get some doors here. That that's not gonna work, is it? We need a door like. I guess I should I should make a. Um, that's not gonna work. I need to make a. Uh, um, did I put one there? No, it's just sitting there. Um, I need to put like a, a a a wall, whatever you call it. How do I get to do that? Because <laughs> I can put it. Because you can walk through diagonals. How do I make that defendable? Hey, migrants! Okay. Uh, give me some more migrants. Oh, eight more dwarves have been named. Who do we have? We have. Um, I'm the beard. Red Cat, Cow Goes Moo Man, I think you were here before. Uh, Clayman Games, Chet, Robert Snow, DJ Flippy, Darren Armstrong, and Hesha. Hesha, the little child. All right, where'd I go? There I am. Praise on Dinty. Praise on Dinty. Yeah, he's going to lay there. How am I going to do that? Um, I guess I can put in. I don't know. Maybe we just maybe we just have an open concept. <laughs> we just leave it open. I don't know. Uh, okay, so let's go get this set up here. Some tables and chairs. I would like some rock thrones. And give me... Um, give me like 21. Give me 20. And then let's add in some rock tables. Yeah, you know, line of traps down the middle of this thing. Like, who, who needs a door? Doors are for chumps. We ain't chumps. Rat folk are chumps. Speaking of chumps, yeah, they are right there. There's Fifty of them in the escorted nightmare. Is that is that the only one they have? They only have the one, the one spot there. I thought there was others. There's one that we burned down. Wicked stalks. I think we burned that one down before. The dark nagas. We don't know who they are. We don't know who anyone is except for the the rat folk. We will, we will murder every last one of them. <laughs> How tough can they be if they need to be escorted? <laughs> okay, table and chairs and everything in there. We'll smooth that all out. Um, we'll get bedrooms here in a minute. That's enough beds for, for now. Uh, when the traders come in, we're going to buy a bunch of wood. What are we going to sell those traders? Well, we're going to make some... Oh, what are we going to do today? We may have some shells. There is some fishing going on. I'm not sure if we actually have any shells. Is there somebody fishing? Ooh, we're going to space. Yeah, we have lots of shells. Okay, and they're all rotten. Um, oh, it looks kind of cool on the, the little mini-map up there. Um, let's go here, and I'm going to tell you to make, with shells, make shell amulets, figurines, Shell figurines and just make them forever. And you know what? I'm going to give you a small stockpile here. 
of shell figurines. And I want things made of... Shell. There you go. Shell stuff goes there. And you know what? I'll even give you a bin. Two doors. In, so I can do... I can, Yeah, I could do a, a three doors in an L shape. Like that. That would work. Um... And that would that would do the job. It would just look kind of kind of funny. How are we doing on still here? Are we stilling? I think we're fine. Um, lots of drink in there, and this is not full. But we'll get some drinks over there. Um, one is going to be a uh, a stockpile room of food. So we'll do this one over here. We'll do food, and we will do drink. I'm going to separate them so that they don't. So we'll do, this will be the food one. My nose is itchy. And then we'll do the drink one over here. Okay, so we have plenty of drink and food nearby. Uh, we'll set up like, we could do like an inn and have different beds that go to my inn. I'm not opposed to that. That's kind of a cool idea. Let's do a... Set up as a dining hall. Like that. Um, it is also the meeting area. Okay. And we can we could set it up as a tavern right now. Sure. The diamond honey. Mm. Delicious. Okay, so I want beds and chairs all around. So we're gonna go like. Let's see how that looks. I can't, this is the, the hardest part of the game. Is trying to figure out where am I going to put my tables and chairs. I know these aren't going to share very well. I know that I like that. Um, we could do something like this. I know it's one chair per table. I get that part. But it doesn't, doesn't always look right. I have like a carpet down here between, between the two. Okay, we'll get more tables and chairs made eventually. And it is now fall. Hey, Hawk. How's it going? Okay, so we got food under control. We've got tables and chairs done. We've got our manager. We've got our uh, bookkeeper. Um, we have a bedroom. I think now we make um, bows and things. Let's get some some sort of weapons. There's our shell figurines, a muscle shell figure of flies, a figurine of a fly man, dwarves, more fly men, dwarves. This is by, this is old, oh, made by Chet. They're laboring. This is a well-designed image of flies. Nice. Um, I'm gonna make a few more bins. I'm going to tell you to make a few bins, but don't make a, like, I'll put it on repeat, just get a few bins, and then I'm going to tell you to stop. I only have a little bit of wood. Have to be cautious with our wood. They should automatically get thrown out here, and we can change this, we can adjust this to only be one. Hey, Mashler, thank you very much. There you go, all the weapons will be in there. There's another bin going over there, so yeah, we'll make a few of these bins, and hopefully one will go here. Oh, you put them all in there, didn't you? Um, I don't really want you to do that. Um, bins are fine. I want you to not have shell things in here. Okay. Um, 
merchants are here. I'm going to adjust a couple things, though. I want you to... One bin. Can I copy and paste this? And you... You can probably actually have more than one bin, but I'm going to put... We'll put two bins in there. Okay, so here come my uh, my traders. This fellow's arrived. I'm gonna get a bargain here already. Um, hello, Jeff says Raoul. Hello. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, not if you've. Ever uh, a need for powder is expected. If you provide some, the caravan will offer 197%. Powder, eh? Okay, well, uh, not gonna happen. But we'll send some goods over here. We are selling you bins of finished goods. What do you got in there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one. Okay, that'll do it. Anything else that I have that I can sell you? We can, there we go. Some figurines. Oh, we got a figurine of Jeff. Well, I kind of want that on a pedestal somewhere. A bunch of rough gems we've found already. Cut those. That'd be better money if we cut those things. Um, and that's it. I'd give you the step ladder, but those are expensive because I don't have a lot of wood. A little bit of rum around here. We got some. We got some barrel of seeds. So I'll sell that. Okay. Send the broker over there. Okay, so I will give you my seed barrel, and I'll give you that. Don't want to give you everything in here. Don't want to give you my crutches. I'm not going to give you my ropes. I want splints. Can't have my quivers either. Can't have any of that. Oh, that's the wrong button. I want... I want not give you those. I'm going to give you my figurines. Okay, you can have all those. How much is this worth? 300 bucks. Woo! Big bucks. Um, I'd like to give you more. I should send some more things over here. We need, we need a good a good profit. Um, do you have any wood? You got toy hammers. You have a cow. You have a pig. You got some rum. You have an iron battle axe. Spore tree training sword. That sounds very elven. There's some th uh, cloth, which I probably will buy. Plump helmets, some cheese. Anything else? Nope. We don't have any wood. Okay. I didn't want any anyway. Um, I will buy this battle axe. I'll buy some cow leather armor. And can I have an iron helmet? Oh, yeah, yeah. Give us a little bit of a... Of a defense. That makes me yellow. We'll just do, the, do that one. Okay, trade. Okay, I'm gonna bring some more stuff over here though. Uh, we've got a bunch of gems. Oh, not that one. Um, I have a bunch of rough gems. They're not worth a ton. That one is. Let's just give them all this. We can we can get more gems. Move those over there, and then we'll trade those, and we're gonna give them to them so just so we can we can raise our um, our export value. Show them, hey, we got we got some things here. Another four you two. That's something. Um, I'll take a couple water skins. I have a couple ropes. I'll take an extra rope. You have a peacock in there. I'll take a barrel of rum. Oh, uh, just give me some barrels. Empty barrel, fourteen bucks. Yeah, you know what? Rather than make them myself, I don't have a lot of wood. Some got bee venom? Sure. Is there anything else in here that was worth grabbing? 
Grab a couple chests. Um, give me a couple bags. Give me a couple cheat bags. I'll take some with sand in them. And, ooh, cloth. Yeah, cloth and leather would be good to have. Because I didn't set up my my, my um, embark. I don't have, like, cats to, to eat or get leather from. Which sounds terrible, I'm sorry. Okay, trade that. Okay. <clears throat> uh, what we could do is get, like, a jeweler set up and so we can maybe get some things made for selling. Like that. Um, let's go look. I didn't actually go down any. I don't know that I need to, though. What is this? This is a micro client, and we got some praise in there. Um, yeah, we'll mine, we'll mine that all out. We'll see what we can find. Okay. Uh, no more of those. Stop that now. Okay, and then your job is to cut gems. We got no gems, he says. You just traded them all away. Okay, yeah, I understand. We'll just kind of dig out this way. We'll dig out this way. What did I just do? I'm lost. My scroll wheel appears, appears to be a little wonky. Easy there, scroll wheel. Okay, some tourmalines. All right, now you got some gems. Now you can do do what I ask you to do. Got some gems. Okay. Hello, Chris. Cats are an important part of a balanced dwarven diet. That's right. That's right. And I don't have any. I don't think we have any cats. Oh, we do that. We do it. But we have two girl cats. I need a boy cat. Oh, I got two girl dogs. I need a boy dog. What am I gonna raise? I got a I got a couple horses. We could raise horses to eat and get milk out of, and not milk, but uh, um, soap. Yeah, we got a baby already. I think the horses are gonna be our um, cash crop. Just gemmed right there. So much for all that. Big open area here. That's fine. Not as pretty up there as it is. Like, this is, this looks nice, doesn't it? Everything works all nice and neat. Just like it should be. Um, I don't know if I have any more beds. Do I have any more? I think I might set up. Something like that. Um, and set in... Like a quarters, you know? Like a... Um, for visitors. It can be kind of a tight fit, isn't it? Let me do it this way. How do I cancel those? Maybe we do it this way. So you come in, there's like a hallway, and then doors. Really can only get two in there. In this channel, cats are for eating, puppies are for coats, horses are for glue. Are for glue. <laughs> Why can't it be straight?
No, nope, wrong one. Uh, I'm trying to move the floor, a wall. We'll just double wall it so it's nice and... It's okay. And then we'll put in a door. There and there. Well, when, when that gets done. Those will be our two rooms. This is a fancy place. You know, we only got two rooms. Don't go asking for anything else. You want to come stay at our place? Two rooms. You pay, better pay a lot of money for it. This, is, this isn't a Motel 6. This is a Motel 2. Okay. Doors. Door, door. There we go. Okay. And so then we should be able to say... I want to paint this zone and add in that. And so I believe if we... Well, not one bedroom. I forgot how to do this. Um, already in use. Is it already marked as being part of that? How do I see the info here? Rooms, to rooms total zero. Um, maybe because there's no bed yet. Yeah, that's a problem. Donkey is starving. Okay, sorry, donkey. Oh, I forgot about you. So let's go back up here and let's go make some more beds. He's part of the tavern. I th maybe. I think, I think you're probably right, but I want to test this out. Okay, so if we say. Not part of the tavern. Okay, and then we add in a bedroom. Like that. And then we select these bedrooms and we say they are part of the diamond honey. Uh, diamond honey. <clears throat> Like that. So then we come over here, and we have, yay, two bedrooms. One of them is rented. Ain't no goblets in this place. What a kind of a dump are we running here? Made me some mugs. We don't have to make a bunch. We'll make a few of those. Rock mugs. Okay, and then we'll put a chest down here. We're not savages. Chest there, chest there. Um, is that all part? It's not quite part of it, so we got to adjust that to be expanded into here. Like that. Okay, and I don't think that... So that's... We also have the, the unnamed meeting hall, which is just where sort of our dwarves hang out. The dining hall. Do we want that to be included in there? I think it's fine. Yeah, the mugs are in there. Okay, so they're set. So now, we got mugs. No instruments yet. No tavern keeper yet. We'll get that. We'll get there. We can always add in two more rooms over here. Yeah, what a place. This isn't This isn't world conquering. This is tavern time. My favorite song. Oh, this isn't it. I thought it was going to play it next. Um, so let's go here. Not there. I want to go to my, my... I had you guys come in, right? Is that from the last one? I did have new guys come in. Okay. Um. Okay, let me let me get a um a scold. 
Anyone else want, um, I think I saw Mangus. You wanted a, a, a name? I'll throw you guys in here since you're here in chat. The Strand Extractor. Mangus. My fortress is out of food. What? Yeah, we probably should deal with that. That's, um, something we probably should take care of. <laughs> Hang on, I'm busy naming people. Um, is that all we got? Just the two? So dull. It's going to be Harley. Of course. Although you, you go, I think all of you are already in this world. You might, you might die of starvation here in just a second. So don't get, don't get too excited. There's plump helmets. Uh, kitchen. I didn't set you any tasks. Let's make some easy meals. Just make them. Plump helmets are in there. Maybe I should expand this a little bit. Um, I like the look of it though, as it is. I suppose we could make it one bigger. We could add in another zone. Without looking too dumb. What was I doing with this? What was the point of this? I don't remember. Hey, no dirt in there. There should be plenty of plump helmets though to keep us to keep us fed. There we go. We got three of them now. Uh, do we have a? Yeah, who's that? Blue dragon's got it. Ooh, look at all that limonite. So there's some dirt there. There's a big dirt. That would be a good farm plot actually right there. If I was thinking of changing things around. That, that's going to last, like with 18, that's fine. Um, but any more than that, we're... Well, 100, we're going to need more than that. Okay. Um, we should have some... Oh, um... Let's go set up a fishing spot. Which I guess he's already doing, isn't he? Yeah, he's already on it. All the shells there, he's already on it. We can, like, designate a specific spot, but I don't really care. We can maybe, we could, like, bring the water to us a little closer. Think we can handle that? Think that would work? I bet it would. Let's channel some water over here. Bring it over here to our base. And then we can just like farm, you know, we can fish fr from our window. And we get a moat out of it. Uh, maybe we should go a little further out than that, because we got to keep our animals in here. Um, is my music off? Music. Let's go out to like here. Like that, so we'll go ahead and break this guy down. We'll fill this in. We'll actually go a couple levels down and fill that all in. Moat building time. We'll get a bridge. We'll throw a bridge over it. Perfect. I mean, you can still get to us. You can go around the mountain, but um, we could uh, adjust this a little bit and have like a little steeper.
We'll remove some ramps. ramps there. Get rid of these. I'll leave, I'll leave a small ramp for now uh, so we can get out of here. We'll, we'll eventually get rid of that. And then... That's it, right? I think we're going to go one more layer down, though. We'll let it just fill in. Merchants are visiting rattlesnakes. Okay, so there's that. I'll get rid of those ramps. Okay, and then we'll do one more layer down. Okay. Moat building time. I don't know how I end up always building moats, but... Like a good moat. Let's go ahead and get our bridge set up um, this way. We want construction bridge. Let's go raise this way and I want it to be like that, I think. Nice big one. I'm gonna go more. Nice big bridge. Make it out of. Ooh, jet would be cool, but I don't have enough for that. Claystone, I guess. Then we'll need to get a uh, mechanism shop in here so we get this this done. Uh, what I was gonna do is I'm gonna put another row like a like a aisle here, and then have another row of shops. Modus operandi. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, done? Done. Uh, let's remove these uh, uh, ramps. All ramps gone. We'll leave that one right there for now, and then we will remove it shortly. we got to get that guy out of there somehow. <clears throat> I'm trying to find you good ones. I got, I got, I got a bunch of, um, well, not, not top tier. So, um, mm. yes, um, I know I gotta have, I gotta have a good one in here somewhere. So, my wife today shouts up at me. She's downstairs. Pretend I have a two-story house. She shouts at, do you ever feel any, like, any shooting pains across your body? Like someone's got like a voodoo doll and they're stabbing you? And I said, no. A minute goes by and she says, how about now? 
Maybe if I if I just pretend like it's the funniest joke I've ever heard. <laughs> then, then that'll do it. Voodoo doll jokes. <laughs> I know those those are the bargain bin. I'm sorry. Giving you bargain bin dad jokes. Oof is right. Okay, uh, let's remove that guy. Oh, that guy. And... I think we can move, remove that safely without actually going all the way down there. Right? Don't go way down there. Just stand on the top and do it. You idiot! What'd you do that for? Well... I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to flood him. Why'd you do that? Um. It's all right. We'll get our way out. Okay. He made it out and he was able to flood everything for us. Here we go. We ran around the mountain here, which we should make this a little more sheer. Um, here we go. Hooray. Did I do that right? Uh, that one's what I want. I don't know that we can actually get... Yeah, we should be able to get to that. Maybe not. Um, man, it's okay. Yeah, I could have dug it out and then and then done. That's what I normally do is do a tunnel and like a stair... Or just like stairs or something. Who cares if they get flooded? Um, that'll be okay, I suppose. Okay, there we go. We got a moat. We still don't have a door in front of our place, but we got a moat. Let's throw us a door. I'm going to go ahead and do the L, the L thing. that. Oh, I can't, can I? Um, yeah, because you have to have, doors have to, they can't be just like, I don't think it can be built like that. Nope. So I have to put in a, a pillar. There. You still walk diagonally through there, but I have to put a pillar up so that it at least blocks things from coming in here. Okay, how's food looking? Okay, food is is looking. Um, I think I'm gonna set this up as a task, which I should have done a long time ago. Um, we want biscuits. What's it? What's it called? Um, easy meal. Just make 50 of those, and when you get below like 25 or 20, to make some more of those, and then we'll do uh, nicer meals also. Fine meal. Okay. Okay, so there's that. Upgrade our, um, that place in a second. Somebody's stealing things. Yeah, we probably should shut our doors. Oh, they got it. Okay, cool. Cool. It's still flooding on in here. We got a nice fishing spot. Our animals are over here. Um... Kias are stealing my stuff, but the walls are now shut. Okay. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I might make this my dwarves place to hang. I'm not sure. Let's go get a mechanic in here. And what else do we want? I mean, like a forge and all that. I was going to put in my, my bow dude. So we get some weapons in here. Do I, do I care about bows right now? I don't have a lot of wood. Is the problem. Make some of those. Uh, you know what? Make a couple traction benches. We'll make one for now. And then Dr. Land will be... We're going to make some bedrooms. Dr. Land will come up here.
So symmetrical. I don't know what's come over me. Let's make med bay there. Med bay would be a big, big med bay, and then we'll have something else up on this side. Maybe a, a temple or something over here. Which we could probably use a temple. Probably use a couple temples, but we'll do um, we'll do two, two, two temples over here. We need a library. We need all this good stuff. A couple temples there. We'll have more statues along the walls. Um. Head bay here in a second, and we need some beds and all that. I'm planning on doing a lot of dying. Furniture attraction bench. I only made one of those, didn't I? There we go. Um. Is it meeting area? Hospital. Okay. Um, over here, we've got... There. Temple. Temple for whoever has a... No worshippers? No worshippers? We got 10 for old Bear Bronze Rocks. Bear Bronze Rocks, that'll be his spot. And then we'll set another one up. I'm gonna try enough gyms. Um, that, and this will just do, um, nobody specific there. We'll give them some stuff in there eventually. I think I might make this like a library right here. Or one of these down, maybe down in here. Or maybe if we could have the rooms flanking and the library on this side. That's pretty neat. Right there. Okay. Um, that one. Library. The House of Towns. Uh, what do you want in here? You want... Oh, yeah, yeah, I need scribes. You need bookcases. Bookcases, tables, chairs. chests in here, too. Okay. We'll do that. And does this... Am I correct that this... And when I set this up as a planning tool, does it automatically add it into here? Without a no. No. I don't think so. Can you make a rock bookcase? Yeah. Uh, ten will do. Look at that. Okay, let's get a lever. Lever's gonna be right in the middle of the place. I think we'll put it, um... Put it right here in the middle of, the, of uh, here. Not too close to the door. Right there on the end. Let me get to um okay. yeah. Brr. 
Berg taking all my gems. We have trouble with no trees means no coal. It's gonna be a problem. I've got two horses now. Okay, so let's eat some horses. I'm gonna slaughter this one. Uh, oh wait, 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 wait. We don't want to slaughter yet. We want to go. Hang on. I want to make sure we get everything ready for it. So, I need a uh, soap maker. Right there. I'm gonna need a butcher. And a tanner. And then I need an ashery, right? Um, that's soap guy. So let's throw in a spot there, and in that spot, we will put I'll put my soap somewhere else. But we can we can put in there is um where does is it food? It's food and fat. Fat can go there. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so we butcher. Um, we should get the, that. We'll have to get our ashery and all that as well. Um, most of that stuff sort of on this side. Ashery. Only like a metal smith and all those. Eventually. I see a couple more trees. Maybe we can do a couple of them grow in or those ones that were here before. I didn't want to chop all of them down because I'm hoping they'll like lay other plants. Let's get rid of those right there. So we'll get that one horse. Um, I need to make ash and I make charcoal. Do like two of each. What are you waiting for? Um, hey, you um, make blocks and just do it forever. You done with your job? Yeah. Um, you know what? And cross, or just cut some more. Okay, and then what we can do is set up a small stockpile here. Oops. And that's going to be. Just bars of uh, none. Um, cool. We'll do one more because there's an ashery right there. Let's just do one like spot right there. It's all going to go into these stockpiles over here, though. Uh, choose a stockpile from which the stuff let's stop. I will take items. Take from that one. They should grab that stuff and put it over here. Bar of charcoal. I think that's how that works. I don't really ever mess with that. Like there's charcoal there. 
It should get hauled over here. Hopefully. So we got drink there. We got drink, food. I think we're good on all that. A little low, but everything's fine. Um, we'll have to do... I think I'm going to make... I may rearrange this and have this just one big farmland. <clears throat> and we'll move stockpile land somewhere else. This is a good place for it. But we could always put stockpile land over here. Oh, baby. Hey, deep. No migrants. It's always the worst. Uh, well, deep. I guess I got one for you. Little tierist. You were just born. You witnessed your birth. All right. Badaga. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so now, oh, I need more beds. Let's make an order of 10 more beds. In fact, let's do like 20 more beds. Wrong one. 20 beds. It's going to be a bunch. Hopefully, we have enough wood for it. I think we have a nice stockpile over there. And bookcases are all in place. Cool. Library is done. Yeah. How you looking, library? Yeah, you're looking pretty good. You don't have written objects in there, of course. Two chests. Okay. We'll get you some stuff shortly. Um, this, You know what? This might be big enough. I can make this into a farm. Rather than having to move everything around... I could just make this a farm. I'm trying to be lazy. But I'll resist. Not big enough. I don't think it'll be a big a problem. We can dump some water in there pretty easily. Masterpiece bed. Okay, so now we should say... A little while since I did this. Um, I see a zone, and I say... Pond. Okay. No, 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 I did the wrong one. Top of a pond will bring buckets of water if the pond below isn't filled. Okay, yeah, and then... I did the right one, and then I, and then I pit the other one. Am I doing that right? It's been a while. Um, this one, and then I say... Well, I guess I could just say water source. Water source. All right, and we got buckets. So they take the buckets and dump it in there, I think is what's going to happen. Uh, speaking of buckets, I may need to make some. So, I believe I did this right, but I don't know. I might put this not far enough, not down far enough. Yeah, I think I did too low. So yeah, I think I can put it, uh, I can just need to put it like on two squares here and it'll work. 
Let me add in that just in case. There we go. Now it's working. Okay. 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 Grab water. Dump it in there. This will get dirty. Farm. Uh, let's do another one of these rooms over here. Let's get in construction of a wall. Just like we did over there. Put in a door. And a couple beds. I'm going to put those. All right. Like that. We'll give them a chest and whatever if they, if they need. Add to the that one. Oops. Okay. Uh, let's smooth. We'll smart, smooth this place first. We don't have a military yet. We should probably get one. Do we ever get that ash main? Lie. Okay. So what I want to do is we're here to pets, and we're gonna start farming horses. For, for, um, what I'm trying to say, for, uh, uh, soap. So we're going to slaughter that guy. Uh, I'm going to tell the kitchen. I'm going to pause you. There goes the horse. Sad story. But we have, we have, we will have soap. Uh, I'm gonna pause you real quick. So in here we got some horse fat. Uh, the towel is what we want to make sure we save. I don't know why there's always some, this is such a tricky thing. So when we get some tallow, we'll make sure we don't don't cook the tallow. It'll come over here and get processed, rendered. That's the word. Turn into tallow. Okay, now that we have tallow, don't make any meals. Um, forbid it. Uh, come over here. Labor. Kitchen. Um, how about now? Where's my tallow at? Being used to make something. What's it being used for? There it is. Okay. No, cook the tallow. Okay, so cook ta horse tallow will never be cooked because we're going to use it to make soap. So we go to Soap Man. Soap Man over here, and we say, Soap Man! I want you to make me some stuff, but uh, are we not, we're not cooking it, are we? Where'd it go? I don't know where it went. Might be going to a stockpile somewhere. I was going right there, actually. Well, it, we, a lie containing item. You've got... Do you make that, make that lie? Make that lie. So that's the ash. And is a lie just like ash and water? No migrants again. We never get migrants. That's probably the last time we never got any migrants. I think maybe there's something up with um, just not enough migrants uh, in the world. So make soap from tallow. Just do it as much as you can so we'll have a little bit of soap laying around. Here we go. He grabs that, makes the soap. We're going to go to the doctor, which is up this way, and it should get tossed in there. 
we'll go ahead and put in a chest. Uh, furniture, chest, a couple of those in there, which I don't think I have any. Make me some chests. Tens a lot, but that's okay. Any trees around here that need chopping? There's one. No migrants. Summertime. Fancy beds. Need empty food storage item. Yeah, I gotta get some barrels, but we'll just make some jugs. Let's just tell this guy, uh, stop doing that and just make me some jugs. Rock jugs. Is that in here? Rock jug. Make a bunch of those. Okay, when the chest gets done, we will have soap. We should have a bar of soap already in here. We'll get some soap. There it is. Horse soap. Excellent. Hey, Neelis, how's it going? Daddy, can I ride the horsey? No, child, we need soap. <laughs> yep. That's about right. All right, I got such a massive doctor's office, but no one has any beds. Okay, so let's go make some beds. Do something like that. Um, and then we'll go... This way. And then it's bedtime. Not bedtime, but it's time to make beds. And then two more. That's not going to work. I can't have it all nice and neat looking and then having it looking dumb. It's bedroom time. I know it's everyone's favorite time for Dwarf Fortress streams. Bedroom time. Look at that. Um, we'll do the same thing on the other side. Don't sleep on bedroom time. That's right. Uh, what are we doing today? We well, this is the, this is day one, but we are going to conquer the world. It's gonna take some time to get there, but we will conquer the world. It's a tiny world. I didn't talk about this before, but um, it's only year eight. I started this, I think, on year like three or something. Actually, I think I'm in year like one or two. Um, we are the dwarves. There are rat folk out there. There are. Lots, actually, lots of rat folk. There's elves, naga, uh, there's some gnolls here to the south. And my goal is to conquer this tiny, tiny place. Yes, same thing we do every night. It'd be nice if there was, you know, if I put like a ladder, like a stairway down over here, that'd be kind of, that'd be kind of nice. Can I fit one of those in and make it look good? Like, can we do like a stairway over here? Like that. Who's that? Vituri, thank you very much. How have you been, Vituri? Oh, it's gonna line up perfectly. Ooh, that's gonna be kinda that's that's close. That's okay, we're not going down, we're going we're going going up, we're going down. Look at that. Excellent. Alright, 
I could fit another bed in, in on this side, couldn't I? Yeah, let's do it. Is that coal? <gasps> Bituminous coal! Yes. That's what I wanted. That's 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 what I was looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, well we know it's on that level. Is there some here? Oh, there's some here too. Okay. I built this to kind of scope some things out. And we got some lignite. Yeah. Okay. Um let's just it's gonna be kinda of ugly, but we're just gonna dig. How do we do this? That way. And then will they continually dig it? How do we do? I forgot how to do that. Auto? Yes, this is a Steam version. Hey, awesome world. Okay, so there's a coal, which is good stuff, which means we can now make metal things. So we have a workshops over on this side, and let's get a, we want a smelter. We want... A metalsmith. Right there. I'm going to set up a... There's room, but I'm going to set up a here a spot for our metal bars. No, oh, no metal bars over here. So only the metal bars will go over there. I'm going to come over here and say, Hey, you. I'm going to customize this stockpile. Uh, that one. I'm going to say I want you to not have any metal. And also don't have any... No ash and no coal either. And really no soap either. No soap either. That's all going to go in here and you guys should have some soap. Horse soap! Excellent. So this place is looking... Is looking... Like it needs a medical dwarf. Medical dwarf is going to be ooh, Mangus. He extracts strands. Sounds like a medical dwarf. Okay, there's my bedrooms. Someone's gonna get a patch of dirt in their bedroom. Uh, let's go make some beds. That uh, we want some doors. Can I just like do no? I'm gonna tear apart the, the dormitory. We can pump those beds out and then put them in the rooms. I missed a bed. Bed there. I'll get chests and dressers and all that in there eventually. I can probably do dressers easily. It's just gonna be tough getting chests. Um, I guess we can do coffers. Um, we'll just do we'll do cabinets. Store the clothing in. And we'll go make some cabinets. I lost count of how many I had here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine, so. What's that? 40 or 36 or so? What's the remove construction? Remove those, toss them in the bedrooms. And then we'll set them up with whatever they need. Uh, let's go into here and we'll make some, we need like 40 dress, or uh, um, what's it called? Rock 
cabinet. And I need like 40 of them. And I need more beds. So I'm going to set up another order of, of 20 beds. That should be enough. Can you still set up a work order that check that you have at least one in stock? Yeah, and I normally do that. I haven't done it yet because it's kind of tedious to set up. But I, yeah, I normally will set that up. So we'll have like, check that there's one bed. If there's not one bed, make a bed. You know, that kind of order. Um, I'll get there, but I haven't yet. Oh, whoops, I did that wrong, didn't I? I want all those. I want that. Tedious is a good word for it. Yeah, I mean, it's like... It's like 30 minutes to get everything set up. Chair, table, food, you know, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but once you do it, your colony is stable. Not really anything else you need to do. You're set. Doesn't save them a whole lot of time. This just this leaves them to there. I can maybe go down one more and, and set them up to the front area. Not really. It's fine. It doesn't really save them a whole lot of time, but it, you know, it works. Um, yeah. Oh well. We can maybe go down to this level, I suppose. I think I can dig that out fine. Down here and go down one more. To there. We could go down one more to there, but then it would be a little bit off center. You export your normal work orders in DF Hack now for new forts to use. What? Oh man. I gotta do that. That's great. So I could just set my my orders once and then be done with it. That's nice. Oops. Hmm. Be a little bit off there. I guess I could have bowed it out on all these. Look at all this magnetite. Okay. Um, and the idea is to do something like that. Sort of work my way over here. Caravan has arrived. And then this will go back to these. I'm gonna have kind of a way a way in here. A way in everywhere. From the stairs. Okay, what do we got? Who's this? Who are you? Are you elves? Oh, these are my people. Okay. Sorry, I'm sorry, I called you elves. How dare I? Um outpost liaison is here. The caravan's arrived. Okay, uh yeah, what what you got? world is same as ever. We need amulets. Oh, I'll get you some amulets. I would love to get you some amulets. I didn't really make anything to sell you this time. Um, I don't have a ton of food and drink to sell you either. I got some horse soap. I made a whole bunch of jugs. I guess you're going to get some of those. Is that what's worth so much? Is all these jugs? Yeah. Do you like jugs? Hope so, because that's what you're getting. You like body parts? Oh yeah, I got these gems. That's right. Ooh, look at those. There we go. We don't really know how much they're worth. We're not very good at appraising things, but we're going to give them that. They're not going to give me enough to... We'll just carry them over there, and we'll sell whatever we can. Ooh, maybe we'll buy another horse. We're going to have a whole family of horses. Pasture can go to there. Let's keep them. I suppose we can keep them off of the water. Well, we'll keep them off the bridge. Okay. 
And is there any animals that got added in there? No. How are we doing over here? Uh, we're getting there. We didn't get that back row. Everything else? Not quite. It's getting dumped in there. What I could do... Let's throw in a floor. There. So then let's dump it out over there. Then we'll remove the floor. There we go. So they should stand there and dump it now. That way it'll fill up this back part better. Okay. Uh, broker. Get over there. We'll do some good trade with you guys. We want to make sure that we get, like, we want the outpost to like us. Make sure we're, they know that we're fancy. I'm a broker at. Jeff, where are you at? There he is. Okay. So, uh, they don't seem to think this is worth as much as I thought it was. But that's 7900 bucks. Okay. I'm going to give them all of I will give them it. Why not? I will take your logs. Cool. Um, I will take, you got a bunny, I don't have a bunny, if I had a bunny, that would be a good meat source. I went to soap making school, but I washed out. <laughs> I probably could use a little bit of, of booze, drink. Some buckets, sure, just to save me from, um... Having to make them. Uh, I'll make a. Sp I'll buy the spear and the crossbow. We got money. Buckler's cool. Iron hat. I'll take your gloves. My efforts are legend there. Oh yeah. Okay. Sheep wool. Give me some bags. Bags are nice to have. Rock nuts. $500 box of cloth. $400. I'll, I'll, oh, I want all these. I don't want all the cloth. I want that one. That one. Those those two's plenty. Give me leather. Yeah, a leather bin would be great. These are a lot cheaper. Let me dump, this, the, dump the expensive ones. Pick up the cheap ones. All right, chopping spree. Yeah. Um, I'll take some cougar lungs. Oops. Cougar lungs, yeah. Some fish, sure. Um, how much is this? I'll buy some plump helmets just to kind of restock us. Raspberries, okay. Some yarn. Some pants. Chain leggings. All kinds of cash. So we'll buy. I'll buy all kinds of stuff. Quiver. Cheese. It's worth a lot, but I'll take it. Oh, hey, yeah, instruments. Parchment paper. Oh, you, profit of 3800 bucks and you're yellow? You jerk. He'll, he'll still take it. It's not that big. It, I don't know why it's yellow, though. It's a surprise. Um, yeah, they're getting a, a, a bargain of a deal here, but that's fine. He's ecstatic with the trading. Yeah, I don't know why I turned yellow there. We could have gotten a lot more out of that, but that's fine. I just want to make sure that we get a an imported and exported wealth of, like, a lot. So then they're like, hey, this guy's great. Send some migrants. You know, that kind of thing. Um, I would like... So this is where I start this off. I think I want to go and sort of cliff cliffify this if I can. As best as I can. We may do more at some point, but for now we'll go up to like right there. And we'll just sort of smooth all this stuff. Make sure we're not like digging into my base here, which I might be.
This side's going to be a little more hairy. Let's put some walls up. Do those right there. And then we'll get all that smoothed out. Oh, my doors. I found my doors. Okay, we'll just put a floor on top of that. <laughs> Whoops. What did I do? <laughs> Whoops. Um. Whoops. <laughs> okay. Uh, we we'll, we'll just can't cancel cancel that. <clears throat> no migrants. Why no migrants? Yeah, I got a surprise moat. It was not <laughs> not a water type plan. <laughs> um, I want a floor. Right. Cover all that up with a jet. There we go. Okay, make sure we're all covered up here. Good yet? Are we dumping it in the right spot here? Over here. Over here. I need one more. I could do one more floor. Just make sure they get over there. situations where you look before you leak. Oh boy. Okay, that'll do it. That'll dry up. We'll finally have our other uh, spots. Oh, they sold my parchment. Get the parchment inside. Do I not have a spot for sheets? I just bought that parchment and it wasn't cheap. What is that? What's in there? Oh, the bunny. I forgot I got a bunny. Uh, we'll put him out here. Add a bunny. Who's running all over the place? What's what are you so scared about over here? More flooding. I can understand that. If we get attacked, we're kind of in a bad spot. We don't have any sort of defense here, so we should probably get some. Um, the furnace. I want to make so we can make coke from lignite, coke from bituminous coal, which I'm going to do that. A lot of. Uh, and then the smelter can go and make some things as soon as we get some bars. We may need a second one of these, actually. We may be okay, actually. And I'll set up a second stockpile here of... I think coal is fine. We'll just do more coal. Put the bituminous over there, too. Okay, that's good enough. Make me... Let's smelt some hematite. We got gold in here, too. Smelt some hematite. And we're gonna turn that hematite into some iron stuff. And then we're gonna make ourselves military. Militia commander. It's going to be... Ooh, no one has any skills. Um, I 
Hardly knows how to chop trees down. Well, Skold is a peasant. Skold, you have no job. Which means you now are in command of the army. Um, we'll do metal. We'll do metal armor. Armor folk. Who knows how to swing an axe? Anybody? Clayman Games does. And Mangus, but Mangus is the is the doctor. I'm not gonna send Mangus in there, but we got a thresher here. Anyone doing jobs that I'm not gonna use much of, like a weaver. That's about it. That's about all we got. Bone carver. There you go. There's a decent amount for now. There's a decent group. Let's go make some armor. We want iron. Breastplates. I would like four of those. I'll get everyone one of those. And then let's make an iron. We have a few weapons. Battle axe. Uh, just make me like three of those. And make me some leggings. Five of those. There's iron bars coming in. Excellent. Um, we need some gloves. And some booties. Uh, what are they called? Iron footies. Iron shoes, greaves. What am I, what am I missing? Helmet. There's boots also. Iron boot. Now let's go. Thank you for hanging out again. I hope you have a good one. I'll see you here in a couple days. Um, iron caps will do. Okay. Um, smelt that ore. This should not have claystone blocks. Oh, we're full over here. Uh, let me upgrade you to an additional. You have max 10 bins. Uh, well, you don't have, what do you have, what do you have so many bins for? There's three over there. Let me go take one over and put it over there. I'm out of wood. Need logs. I just bought some logs, though. A lot of logs already? I only got one tree in this whole world. There's one tree left. I'm going to save it for a rainy log infested day. I can't. Can I grow trees? I, mean, I never thought about doing that. Is that one done? We got one spot that's not wet yet. Do we care? I don't think I care. So, let's get rid of this. Let's remove... Remove the bra the, the this thing. And then down here, we're going to put in... As soon as that water dries up, we'll put in our new farm. Oh, the cabinets are done. Oh, you, you took it apart incorrectly. Now there's just a floating nothing. <laughs> oh, and there's... Why didn't that fill in? Because the thing fell on it? How's the bedrooms looking? Stop taking part of it wrong. Oh, wrong. Uh, okay. Uh, I think even if I have the, the door set like that, I think I can still do this. Multi-bedroom, and I can do... This is my favorite. This is the best part of the Steam release. Look at that. Oh, it's fantastic. 32 bedrooms. I would love it. Done. Done. Oh. 
I can't worry about that. Um, well, I don't want that. I want, um, am I out of coal? Ooh, we found a good amount of it, though. Look at all this. Can't, um, I have bituminous coal. Do I have to make coke? I need fuel. Do I have to have charcoal first for that? I mean, I have to go get, I can go get the caves. The problem is the caves are like under an aquifer. Get this last tree. Where is it? If you kickstart it. Yeah. I guess because I ran out, it um, stopped. No, 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 no. Stop that. How many beds do I have left to make? Oh, a bunch. Um, stop that. How are we doing on beds? Oh, we're there. Okay. I never set you up with doors. Okay, so there's that. So now we can make make coke from bituminous coal and just say just do it forever. And then once we do that, then we'll have sort of like an unlimited, as long as we have a bunch, we'll have like an unlimited supply of this stuff. Am I right about that? I think we can put a bin in there, actually. We don't need this big open area here. You're making the charcoal up. What am I missing here? It's work. It's starting, but it's not... Um I need to make more. Hey, T Kitty. Let's go. Let's put my eighteen folks to work here. Place nice. That way, people may even come visit. Yeah, we'll probably have to run to the caverns. 
Once we get lucky, we get a big wood haul in here. We, we got a bit, but not it didn't last very long. We're at the point where we can use more people in this fort. Everyone here in the military should start getting... What are we doing here? Oh, yeah, we're getting there. We need four shields. We need three backpacks and a lot of boots. I've got... I don't actually don't have a leather maker, do I? I have a tanner. I don't have a leather maker. There we go. Okay, they're going to smooth away. Um, I do have a medical dwarf, so I probably should get an office for them. Get a door here. Set that as an office. Mangus. And then I think everyone's happy. Yeah. Mangus didn't, even, didn't really even care about that. Okay, now we got now we got the stuff. Now it's cooking. Okay. And now we can make all this stuff. And now that that's happening, we can go and make some iron bars. I'm trying my lever, light, lever yet. Let's pull it and see what it does. Make sure it works. Watch out, cow. Yeah, hey, it works just fine. Freak that cat out or whatever it was, though. There we go. Excellent. That works. Okay. Nice. We got a nice, nice moat. I like it. Even some, some extra additions as well. Uh, more wood. So we can get... There's two different ways. We can get it from trade, or we can go down into the caves and get mushroom trees. Which is what we'll probably I'll probably have to do. Uh, I want to do a farm plot, so I think we'll do like that, and we'll do one there, and then we'll do a little guy right there. So we'll have a few different varieties of things, some pigtails and stuff, you know, for some cloth, and we'll get the clothing industry set up. And that's where I need to get that saved up, so I can get it all set in there for like make a sock, make a pant, make a shirt, so we can just have the clothing industry done. I need to learn. I'll, I'll figure out how to do that. That will save me a lot of time. Uh, pumpkin helmets are fine in the winter. In the autumn, we will do what's gonna, this is going to be a little one here. We'll do just like I don't have seeds for anything, do I? Where do all my seeds go? I got seeds for nothing. I don't have any. I can't even do big tails. Mm, we can go pick them up. This is a little one. We'll do like just kind of a variety. And that one is going to be. Mostly, I just, want, I just want variety for all of these, just so that we can grow a little something else. And this big one's going to be plump helmets. Human is visiting us. Uh, there probably is some stuff out here. Prickleberries. Well, we can. Well, we can find them in the caves anyway. Young Saguaro. Hey, yeah, there we go. Some, there's some cactus. Humans. Humans. See, I think any way we look at it, we're going to have to go down into the caves. I was kind of trying to uh, avoid it because when I go down there, I get kind of stuck down there. And what I want to do is I want to focus on storming across the land here. we got 50 rats. Steamy fiends over there that they need to be dead. Mm. 
we'll just engrave this this part for now. So I think, yeah, I got a whole bunch of young Sororo here. So I think we'll be all right on the trees. Once they grow up, you know, Sororo would take like 100 years or whatever to grow, but I'm not sure how long they take into a fortress time. So we'll, we'll be good once that happens. Uh, this is part of that, yeah. So this, how you doing here? How you looking? Goblets around, no instruments yet. Uh, I didn't actually make that instrument, did I? I bought parts of an instrument, but I didn't put it together. Make an ibis. Can you make two ibises? Maybe. Spring has arrived. There we go. There's our instrument. I guess they made it out of shell. Will it go down into here? I would think I need a few more mugs also. So let's do one more mug. A couple more mugs. Instrument, I think, is done. Ah, stored instruments. Two instruments. Nice. I don't know what I can do. Um, anyone good at dancing? Intense, persuader, persuader. I don't really want to throw anyone in here. I guess my jeweler could come in here and dance around a little bit. Keep the tavern. We can perform with... My bone carver can come over here and... Oh wait, I got a, a musician, Harley. Yeah, Harley. When you're not when you're not in the military, you in the military. Oh, that's scold. But when you're not doing whatever you do, come play some music down here. Just Chet the Bard, DJ the Thresher. We got a human over here. Looks an awful lot like an elf. Okay, there we go. N new farm. Lots and lots of plump helmets again. So that should solve all those problems that we have over there. Um, my bunny's running around. I don't. I didn't have... I was going to look and see if I had a, a girl bunny. I don't think I did. No. Just a boy bunny. And I still just have the one horse. Um, we'll hold off sla slaughtering any of those. When someone loses their mind and we got to get leather or whatever, we'll slaughter some more. A lot of those I don't need to deal with right now. Okay, I'm going to make this my barracks. Right here in the middle. Weapon racks, armor stands, and then we'll set in our archery target. We don't have any archers, but we'll put them in there so it looks cool. Uh, um, cabinets, and then we want some chests. We don't need so many, but there we go. And then we'll set this up as a barracks. There. So the military will sort of hang around there. Um, I don't want them to sleep there, but they'll train and store their stuff there. <laughs> right. Woodcutter. Woodcutter Harley. Singing about cutting the imaginary trees. Imagine how much it would hurt if that thing fell on you. A big cactus. Hey, more soap. I mean horse. Is that a... Uh, um, oh, yeah. Our door isn't very effective anymore, is it? Because of that. No, what I didn't mean to. I meant to. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. 
<laughs> uh, I meant it's getting too late for me. Um, I meant to put a wall. I meant to flatten it. Let's put a wall there. I think that's fine. It'll be um. Is that okay? Still a hole there, but you can't get into it. Okay. Sort of fixed. Okay, we need four weapon racks, four armor stands. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll do ten. We'll, we'll use them eventually. And then... Look at all that magnetite just laying around, just begging to be turned into iron. Or... Into good stuff. Um... Forge. We got lots of iron bars laying around. All my stuff done. All my work orders are done. Cool. That means everyone is is equipped. No. Everyone has something. We need to get. We need four water skins, three bags, four shields. So let's make some shields. Move it that way. Iron shield. Uh, let's put in a leather man. Hey, baby! Cow goes moo man. Give birth to a girl. What was I doing? Uh, leather. 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 Where's leather at? Leather. Leather. No migrants. Yeah, see, that's the problem we had last time is I never got any more migrants. I think that maybe there's just not enough dwarves. Like, we've got a few. There's 200 there. There's 200. That's a lot. Future Helm. Uh, 10 there. 10 there. 100. There's 100 at Quest Castle? When I left there, there was like two. I'm not sure what happened to Quest Castle. Okay, I want leather backpack. I'll just set up as a work order here. So we want backpacks. I'll do 10 of them, and then I want water skins. 10 of those, too. Uh, we don't have a love, love, uh, maybe not enough, enough leather for that. Let's lower that down a bit. Let's make seven backpacks. Five water skins. I bought some leather, but I didn't buy very much. It was one crate's worth. We have a problem with that. Oh, because of that. Yeah. Put a cage right there. Put a floor there on my, my hole. Okay, leather's happening. Uh, let's go ahead and start up the uh, the tedious one of clothing. And our loom. Um, what's the other order? I want... No automatic weave. Keep the thread all on its own. No oh, empty barrels. Did I sell all those pots that I made? I think I did. That's not here, is it? It's at this one. Okay, uh, military, I got a schedule for you. Uh, you're going to be in the staggered training. I thought I have a lot of you to 
work that, but we need some sort of training here. Yeah, we got armor there too. Cool, armor stands, weapon stands, cool. Max bin's one, and there's two bins in there. What's the deal with that? Okay, so we're gonna make things out of cloth, I suppose. We'll work on, I'm gonna do this this way. Okay, so cloth, we'll make coats. Two coats. Um, if you see less, if you see none, make two coats. I gotta figure out how to save these. We'll do some pants. I'm not sure what cloth pants are called. Uh, robes are also nice to have trousers, is what we want. Um, two of those. There we go. Um, also gonna, they're going to want shoes. The problem is I don't want to have any cloth. I'm hoping to get some with those pigtails. With those pigtails. Um, so. Okay. That's something. Now, I don't have any pigtails though, so I'm gonna have to, I think we should just dig down. What time is it? It's my bedtime. Do we dig down? We went in on a high note and dig down on a, on a high note. That's, that's pretty exciting. Let's do that. We'll go to like, we'll dig this over this way. And then we'll have our dig down right there. Oh, okay. Perfect song to end this song. Let's go down! Okay, we dig. Probably gonna find an aquifer somewhere in here. Some bauxite. Actually, no, I think, I think aquifer is actually not in... Uh, over by the mountain. It's, it's in the other side. Magnetite. Party time. That's right. Stone, gypsum. There it is. Oh, yeah, a little far. Here we go. Okay, so we made our way. Not a bad spot to be right there. We can put a bridge out. Anything heinous out this way? Oh yeah, dance. Dance time. Uh, what am I looking for? Creatures. Other. Oh, just some chinchillas. That ain't so bad. We got tower caps. Ooh, there's some wood right there. There's some plump helmets, quarry bushes, there's some fungi wood, pigtails. Thief! Okay, time to put the uh, the military to work. Where are they? Oh, rat folk! Rat folk and kobolds? Oh no. Okay, so I want to grab you guys. Um, I want you to... I'm just going to tell you to kill. That guy? That guy? Is there anyone else? Does, do we see any more? Where's the cobalt at? All three of them. All of them. Kill them all. Oh, they're coming inside. They're going to the military. Okay. Here we go. Bring the animals back. Is there any of them left? Did we get them all? I think the, I think the kobolds ran. Yeah. Okay. 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 
Um, let's go down to the cavern. We got our floor in there. Um, let's go scoop up. Not those dead big tails. We want the living ones. Dead sweet pods. Can we have some living stuff? Dead quarry bushes. Dead sweet pods. Dead cave. Wait, why is it all dead? Why is everything dead? I want the, I'd like the living stuff besides plump helmets. I got plump helmets. Why is it all dead? Spider silk is nice. We can that that could be what we make everything out of. While we're down here, there's spiders down here. <laughs> I think you're right, Harley. Now well, maybe we'll find some living things down here. Eventually. These are some big mushrooms. Did I discover a deep pit? Where do I discover that at? Oh, hey, look at that. That is a deep pit. Is that into the next the next cave, you think? All right, I, I tried to tell this one um, the other day, and I failed. So, um, pretend like you didn't hear the beginning of this. Because it's, it's the funniest joke I've ever told. That's what, that's what I'm going with. My neighbor uh, was stealing things from the local supermarket. Sitting on the, sho the shoulders of two vampires. Believe it or not. He was charged with shoplifting on two counts. I, I tried to tell that one the other day, and I, I like, I fumbled it royally. Um, and uh, there you go. That, that, that's all I had to say. That's that's it. That's it. Uh, humans have arrived. Humans. Um, well, there's so many things going on. It's my bedtime. I don't care about that. I care about the... Where's the uh, the thing? Uh, I want to go down to where that was. Oh, yeah. That's a big hole. With nothing in it. It's just a big hole and nothing. It's almost like... Volcano looking. Is there scary things out here? Spooky things? Nope. Just humans. Who I really want to kill. I think we can kill them. Like, we're not happy. We're not the friendly people here. There's humans around here. They got little hamlets. What are they going to do to us? Do we know how to... Can we handle some humans? Can we murder some humans? I could have just flung that guy right there. All they've got is a couple merchants. There's an axeman. Where's the other guy at? <laughs> nice masculine. Um... Axeman, Maceman. Where's your friend at? I don't see where the other guy is. Oh, he's over over here already. Do you think, can the five of us kill them? We'll, we'll probably die. And we'll certainly go to war with them. How tough are you? You're an adept Axeman. Where's the other guy at? Axeman Maceman. Where are you? What are you doing down there? I don't know how you are. You're talented. Um, He's not even here. Oh, well, we can fix this. We just pull the lever. We can do it now. Before he gets here. Now, we only have to deal with one now. Okay. This is how we end tonight. Uh, I think we're going to go and... Well... 
I think the I think the five can handle this. Um, let's call him in. I want you all to move and stand here. Let me slow this down a little. I, got, I forgot I turned it up a bit. Um, slow this down to, to normal speed. Okay, here they come. Here's Chet. There's DJ Flippy. Here come the rest. We got Clayman Games. We got Robert Snow and Scold. All right, so we got one guy with an axe. He's the only one we're worried about. The other guy... He's goofing around over here playing with some squirrels or something. Such a human thing to do. All right, we're going to kill that guy. We're going to get them all, but I want to kill that guy first, and then we'll worry about the camel and all that. Here it goes. Here we go. Where's my sound effects? He's terrified while in conflict. How are we looking? Um, we are fighting, we are fighting. Easily parried by the adult. Um, oh, the Axeman, Axeman strikes, but it's easily parried. That's good. That's good. Clayman, you're striking. Human misses. Human misses. The Axe Dwarf strikes the human, in, but the shot's blocked. I've improved my axe, says that Clayman Games. Yeah, you have. Strikes, it's blocked. Hacks the human Axeman in the upper body with her, bo with her battle axe. Deflected by her shirt. Okay, we're learning. Deft. Deftly parried. Uh, how, how's Skull doing? Misses. Deftly deflected. Um, attacks the human. Jumps away. Axeman hacks the commander in the left upper arm with her, gra with her axe. The human is, ta is attacking Skull. The nerve is severed. You dropped your axe. Pick that back up. Picked it back up. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can not die. There's some blood. Scold blood. Let me look at, I don't know why I don't have any sound effects here. Um, I want to see this one. Somebody is biting. Axe Dwarf strikes. Parried away. The recruit bites the human Axeman. Yeah, bite, bite, bite. Axe Dwarf hacks the human Axeman in the left upper arm. Excellent, we're getting him. Oh, definitely uh, deflected. Uh, there we go. The commander, Scold, strikes the human axeman in the right upper leg with her shield, bruising the bone. The spear door stabs the axeman. Excellent. Motor nerve is severed. Okay, now we're getting there. We're getting somewhere. Done. Dead human. Excellent. You ain't done yet. You got more to kill. You gotta get her. Yes. Um, get them. Okay, ooh, there's some body parts flying around. Okay, they're done. Uh, do we want to get the horse? The horse and the camel? Might as well. We're on a bit of a roll here. The horse is scared. We need soap! Oh yeah, hang on. Uh, the human can just run over this mountain here. Let's, let's get everyone to come back. Everyone back over here. Where is... There's still a maceman around. He's still friendly. He's standing right there. We want to go get him? How are we feeling? How's everyone looking? How are we looking? Skull lost their, their axe. Because uh, their arm got a little messed up. Skull's going to rest. How are you feeling? You're injured. You've lost your ability to uh, to grasp. We haven't diagnosed you or anything just yet. Your arm's cut open a bit. Um, that's that's not that's not a good enough excuse. Get back out there. I need everybody to come and stand here. We're gonna we're gonna pull down the lever. Pull that lever.
Pull the lever. Let me pull the dang lever. There it goes. Okay, is he out there still? I don't see him. <laughs> He's still friendly. He's like, ah, da, da. you know. Happens all the time. A friend's dying. Let's go get him. He's out here just admiring our moat. No one looks at our moat and gets away with it. There's only two of us there now because we're a little beat up. Who's in there? We've got uh, Clayman Games and J DJ Flippy. There's some Clayman Games blood. Lots of Clayman Games blood. Human blood. Um, DJ Flippy apparently has lost their gear because they're not carrying any weapons again. Can we get everyone else over here? Here comes Robert Snow. There's lots of DJ Flippy teeth. The Maceman has lost his weapon, though. We got him. We got him. Ah, teeth go flying. There we go. We got him. Okay. Well done, everyone. Well done. Go get go get yourself a, a rub down with some uh, some horse soap. Oh, DJ Flippy died. Oh. Well, on the bright side, we got a whole bunch of new stuff. What we got over here? Let's go grab all this stuff. It's all mine. Give it to me. Okay, and uh, everything's uh, everything's mine now. We've got what do we have in there? Some sandbags, some chests, some bolts, a silver great axe, uh, ooh, an instrument. Nice, a flail, iron flail. That's cool. Two-handed sword. An anvil was in there. Another two-handed sword. Lungfish. Do you have any like anything really cool? There's not a lot of because it's so early in the game. There's not a lot of um, um, artifacts. There's a nice altar there. Another alba. More weapons. Lots of gems. Cool. Some horse cheese. Oh, we love horse. No migrants. Never get any migrants. Apparently, that didn't anger the humans enough to for them to fight me, though. We can. I think you can make things out of teeth. I think it counts as bone. I'm not sure, actually. But yeah, we'll go get uh uh DJ. We'll get DJ Flippy a nice spot here on the row. I built this for that reason. So let's go over here and make a coffin. Let's make it now, please. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Taps have been played for Flippy in the tavern tonight. So yeah, yeah. Good day, good day. Um, I... Oh, this is what I wanted to try, is... Glass and gym windows. I want to try a paved road, but if I say do like... Oh, I can't because the chairs are there. And if I make it out of something like rose gold, it won't look like anything. What if I do iron? I have 72 iron bars laying around. I think it's going to look like that. So it doesn't matter what it looks like. We'll see. If it looks, like, if it looks kind of blue, then, then I'll be happy. Okay. Um, let's go set them up over here. See if it's done. There we go. We'll mark this as a tomb. In it. Right, what am I missing? Designate a tomb before it'll be used as a coffin. Huh. Not enclosed. What do you mean not enclosed? Is that a new thing? Does it have to be enclosed now? Wait a minute. Is that a new thing? Do they have to be uh, like behind a door? Because I have multi on. Hmm. 
Hmm. What about now? He's in there now. Um, okay. Huh. That's different. But okay. Uh, Blue Dragon's getting uh, getting some bed. How you feeling, buddy? I never... I don't think we have anyone to do this. You need to diagnose. We need die. We need doctors. Um, so we need... We need a doctor, which I think we're going to put as... What do we have here? No one's really skilled in any of this stuff. Um, we have a chief medical dwarf, which is Mangus. We'll let him be doctor. Um, diagnostician. It's not telling me who's good at what. I suppose... Um, cow go... Oh, uh, Robert the Weaver. Surgeon? Maybe that should be the Weaver. The furnace operator? Bone doctor. And weaponsmith. Okay. We have everything in here. We're missing some powder. I'm always missing powder, but... How are you doing now? Your, right, your upper arm needs immobilization, which means we need to get a cast. Upper arm is fractured. Okay. Is that it? The skull not get whooped? Like, beat down? Or skull that... Or a scold. Why can't I see scold? Yeah. Are you healthy? Oh, you a little sensory nerve damage, but that's okay. Happens to the best of us. That track is um, old Kevin McLeod. It's in basically every every indie game. Um, it has a lot of these the same songs. Hey, I'm surprised we're not at war with him yet. Maybe it'll show up later. I'm not sure, even sure who that was. If it was the Realm's Consideration that came at us, or was it the Council of... Or the, uh, sorry, the Empire Stopping? Or the Copper Nations? These are all humans. I'm assuming it's these guys right here next to me. Realms of Consideration. It says no contact, though. And that's weird. Hmm. Out of, out of rocks. Okay. Well, uh, it's my bedtime, so I'm going to call it a day. So thanks for hanging out. Clear out some of these things. Got some quarry bushes. Hey, here we go. Let's get this so I can have at least some of these things done. Uh, sweet pods. Give us some seeds. Have anything that's alive here? Eve wait. Praise on Timothy. More sweet pods. Really looking for these guys. Pigtails. Well, we're we'll after some quarry bushes anyway. We can grow those. There's a lot of spider silk down here. I'm surprised we don't see any spiders. Like big spiders. Nope. Okay. People should start getting a little bit happier. We've got a couple grumpy folks, but most folks are, are uh, happy. But yeah, we got some trees now, so we have wood. Wood is back on the menu. Um, there's a doggy. Did I get any... Oh, oh, um... I should check real quick if I got any animals out of that. From the humans. I did not, it looks like. Nothing encaged up in there? Are there anything in here? Ooh, my stockpile is packed now. Which one's the animal one? Is it... 
That's not it. This one, right? Yeah. So we got a couple cages, but no uh, no animals. Something for our girl bunny. And some more uh, more shirts. That's large. We can't wear that one. We can wear the pants. We can eventually get some more folks. We only down to four now in our military. Um, hopefully, we get some migrants at some point. We don't get migrants. This though, this this is gonna be tough. We don't get migrants. We're gonna have to just like have babies. I didn't mean I did that wrong, didn't I? I meant to do uh, not that kind. I wanted to do a trap, a cage trap is what I meant to do. Not that. Anyway, let's call it a day. Thanks for hanging out for another day of Dwarf Fortress. I'll be back with this fort at some point. Um, I'll eventually... Someone's vomiting all over the place. Uh, we will eventually conquer this world. It's going to be kind of tough. But eventually we'll get it. Maybe. Maybe. We'll take something out. We, we've burned a few things down, but we got we got a lot more to go. And there's a human hamlet of 30 people. That shouldn't be too bad. Oh, there's a human hamlet of 10 people? Oh, that's Knowles. We'll get all geared up, stomp out there, take some folks down. All the magnetite laying around, we'll turn that into copper and maybe we'll build some copper floors or something. All right, so let's save this one. Okay, thanks for hanging out. Um, I will, I'll be here for D&D &D tomorrow. I won't, I won't be here for a, a normal stream, normal stream time tomorrow. Got some uh, a couple sponsored things I gotta get done, but then I'll be back here Friday night, and we'll play something else. Thank you for hanging out, and I will see you, if not tomorrow, I'll see you in a couple days.